video. So it's 15 odors and five come away with spots in the break for dirt cheap. Seven times through. You want to be in the top five to score a spot into the box? It's a third of a chance for around a third of the price. Lucky number seven. And there is our top five. Congratulations. Those of you who made it into the box. Now we have our complete owner list. Of course, every spot is worth two teams. So I'll double the owner list and start the random to see who gets what team in the box break. Seven times through for the owners, seven times through for the teams. Ho! Paul, how's your night going tonight, man? Good to see you. Lucky number seven. Oh, man, Joey. It is risky business, man. It's risky. No doubt about it. It's risky. Oops. Good luck getting some of the best teams like the Dodgers. The Astros. Here we go seven times. The Padres. The Mets. Toronto. Lucky number seven. Who's going to get the Yankees? All right. You can see your team lined up right here. Brian, you got the Red Sox. Jeffrey W. got the Dodgers. Oh, my. Oh, my. Yankees. Who got the Yankees? I can't find it. Okay, Brian. Wow, Brian, you got some good teams, man. Oh, my goodness. Let's see what happens in the break. Let's sort this in alphabetical order. There are no trades that I can see. No trades. Mets or Cubs for Braves. Mets or Cubs for Braves. Anthony I. I don't know if he's here or not. Tanner has the Mets and the Cubs. You can stop me at any time if you're considering that trade. Or you could even trade through the break. It's fine if you decide you want to do it. Just say, hey, stop and I'll stop. And then you, we can make the trade. Oh, we've got Clemente. That is a short print. 
And I always look at the back because we're looking for bubblegum backs. The bubblegum backs are very rare, but we pulled one the other day of a Babe Ruth bubblegum back. And I bet you that thing has some big value, man. Them bub those bubblegum backs, you, <laughs> they are extremely rare. I think we're talking about it. It's like one in 1,600 packs that you hit a bubblegum back short print nice Gavin Lux rookie card who Dodgers I think it was one in 1685 <laughs> that was a great hit the other day with the bubble gun back We got two autographs coming up in our box break. Wishing you the best of luck. We're looking for some of the rare things that you can find in Gypsy. And um, hopefully we can find something really rare. Keep an eye on this top left corner. Oh, there's a no name plate. Okay, so you got to watch these things. This is a Braves no name plate. And that is Ender... Oh, I don't know how to say his name. But that's a nice one. A no name plate. And we're looking for the logo swap, which is the GQ. And instead of there being a GQ on the top left, we're looking for a lady emblem. An old lady emblem. It's not an air card. What it means is it's just more rare. Uh, uh, no nameplate just means it's a rare variation and instead of making like a numbered parallel that you see so many times in other brands um, they instead of doing that they just in honor of, of old school cards they're like replicating an error card that's kind of the idea is that they're replicating what used to happen so many years ago and celebrating older type of sets. Uh, Tops Gypsy Queen is doing that by making error type variations. That's exactly what they're celebrating is air cards. Nice Walker Bueller. <laughs> All right. King of Wands. What else is coming out of here? Oh, it's our autograph. Good luck, everybody. Here, here we go. We got our auto. What's it going to be? It's a Bobby Bradley for the Cleveland Indians. Nice auto. Bobby Bradley. Rookie for Joe G. Way to go, Joe. And, of course, everything ships in Gypsy Queen. Everything you see here coming out. Here we go. Blue Parallel. And it's a Astros Brantley. Houston Astros hit. Got 17 of 150 right here on the rare Brantley. It's a nice rookie card of Alvarez. Really nice. That's a cool Alvarez.
there it is. There's a parallel right there. You see the old lady on the top left. This is called the weekend variation. He's wearing a special uniform right here. So these are really rare too. And uh, each kind of parallel has a certain degree of rarity. That is a rare one. I haven't seen too many like that. Another variation here, and this must be the Camo variation. I don't know what this variation is yet. Is this the uh, Jackie Robinson? No, I don't see Jackie Robinson. I don't see Camo either. Anybody know what kind of variation we're looking at? Hmm. That's going to be a great hit for somebody. I just wish I knew the variation right now. I don't see it. I have to link you up with our variations guide. And you can look that one up. I don't see any camo piece that he's wearing. I don't see the weekend jersey. And I don't see the... Um, Jackie Robinson patch. Yeah, I'll have to look at that, Steve. At the end of the break, nice Aaron Judge. At the end of the break, I'll look at the code on the back, and we'll we'll determine. We'll go to that variations page, and it'll be really easy to quickly verify which variation that is. Should be pretty easy to identify. By the numbers on the back. That was good thinking there, Steve. That's right. The numbers on the back will tell us. Well, we still have that second autograph. And I want to wish everybody good luck in the break. Second auto is coming up. Oh, there it is. It's Miguel Cabrera. Tigers. Ho. Miguel Cabrera. Boom. Nice hit in the box break. Yeah. Go ahead. Siri, I was not talking to you, Siri. I don't know what you mean by. Siri, uh, I was that. How about a web search for it? <laughs> oh, great. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe it's just the logo swap. You're right. That's what it is because I would have been able to spot the other ones. There's a no name plate. Who? Torres. Nice. Yankees hit. That's what it is, you guys. It's just a logo swap. We'll look at the last three digits. By the way, nice Torres. There's a really good Mike Trout. Final pack. And then we have our Crow Box Topper. Twins owner, a nice one. A Chris Bryant, ho! And a Harper. So some really great ones right there. And we'll see if we can distinguish this hit. And 
we're looking at the bottom three. Looks like the number 42. And here's our variations page. The Brian is not numbered. It's a chrome, but it is not numbered. And here's a link to our variations page. Let's see. It's fun, you guys. Good luck in our very next box break coming up in a moment. Okay, so it's a base logo swap is what we discovered. But here's a link to All About Gypsy Queen. Vix, my dog, wants to know if the Miggy is for sale. Miguel Cabrera. Okay, here's the variations guide. So anyway, we're going to get to the next break. That was a logo swap card. Which is considered a base variation. 42 is a base variation. Brian isn't numbered, but they're a little more rare. You can see about those Chrome cards, Tanner, on that link I just posted. So anyway, we'll be ready for the next Gypsy Queen before you know it. It's down to 10 left. There's no fillers or nothing. It's just 10 spots left in the break, you guys. So that'll be happening really soon. I'll get our countdown board up here. We got one left in Ultimate. So I'm going to start getting everything ready for Ultimate Baseball. One spot left in there. Six autos coming up. Ho! Oh, Dunruss has a filler left. And there's 11 spots left in the filler. Eight left in Inception Baseball. If you're looking for a break, hopefully you can find one pretty easily. Ten left in Leaf Metal Draft. Here's a link to our football section. Should be able to find a rip that is close very easily. You can see the NT division break now at two left, nine left in the. Uh, it's right there, football section. The whole foot, this whole page is what I've linked up, so you can just easily navigate around. And then up here, you can see you can go to baseball if you hover over it. Here's the baseball page. So it should be pretty easy to navigate. It's not that hard. Here's football page. Here's basketball page. So anything you want, man, just hover over group breaks there at the top of the link. And then um, on the home page, you'll find hockey.
Okay, here's a link to the one with one lab fanatical. All right, somebody already got it. It's on the baseball section. The, the next closest one would probably be the jersey break. Over here in the football section or the NT. I'm getting everything ready for the break. Good luck. It used to be our moderators would post links into the chat, so I wouldn't have to even post a link. I'd just be able to get to the next break and start getting it ready. It's a, it's always a big help if you guys do post links, man. It's It makes it to where I can get our into our break sooner. But I can't wait to see. It's time for ultimate. We're going to hit something big. We have more ultimate available too. And so there's another ultimate popping up. Available right now. Fifteen spots and six hits in Ultimate Baseball. You can see all the different things getting closer. I'll update this section of all these breaks getting closer. Right now, it's a little. This just gives you an idea of some of our hottest boxes that are coming up. But it's not even close to being accurate. Because National Treasure is down to three. Or I think even two. That was a fun break of Gypsy Queen, man. That is some good stuff. Gypsy Queen baseball. Hope. VM, did you ever, were you able to ever get signed in? Hopefully it fixed itself. Oh, nice. I thought it would. I was hoping it would. <laughs> well, thanks, man. I appreciate you. I hope you hit something big. Always a lot of fun, man. 
Hey, CJ. What's up? <laughs> CJ, are you still quarantining? <laughs> you still in the big quarantine? Hope you're doing all right. <laughs> oh, man. You're in your padded room. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> You're in the old padded room, huh? <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> okay well i would listen to those guys in the white jackets how would you those guys in the white jackets you want to listen to them this is full yeah ultimate baseball is ripping up getting everything ready I almost got it all ready almost got everything ready for this thing and then uh, we have a lot of breaks that are really close. Unfortunately, our my Excel program crashed, so the countdown board's a little off. The countdown is off. I'll have to get that accurate in a minute. But those those boxes at orange are kind of like the hottest box breaks. I think we're out of this one. Those are kind of like the hottest boxes. I'll fix that countdown list after this break or if nothing's sold out. But right now, it's time for Ultimate. Good luck. Ultimate Baseball. CJ, those guys in the white jacket, they, they know what they're talking about. <laughs> Those guys in the white jacket. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, here we go. Each spot's worth seven on the checklist. So I'm going to multiply the owner list here by seven. Let's do a big random. <laughs> 